Imagine waking up tomorrow to discover that time, as we've always known it, doesn't actually exist. That the ticking of the clock, the aging of our bodies, the very concept of the present moment, all are illusions. What if our entire perception of time is merely a construct of our minds? Welcome to the enigmatic world of time, where physics, philosophy, and cosmology intertwine to challenge our understanding of reality. The human perception of time. From the moment we're born, time governs our lives. We celebrate birthdays, schedule meetings, and reminisce about the past. But what exactly is time? To us, time feels linear. There's a past we remember, a present we experience, and a future we anticipate. This perception is deeply rooted in our consciousness and daily experiences. However, when we delve into the realm of physics, this intuitive understanding begins to unravel. Newtonian time, the absolute clock. In the 17th century, Sir Isaac Newton introduced the concept of absolute time. He envisioned time as a constant, unchanging backdrop against which events occur. According to Newton, time flows uniformly, independent of the observer or the events happening within it. This model served science well for centuries, providing a framework for classical mechanics and our everyday experiences. But it couldn't explain certain phenomena observed in the universe. Einstein's relativity, time is relative. In the early 20th century, Einstein revolutionized our understanding of time with his theories of relativity. According to Einstein's special relativity, time is not absolute. Instead, it's relative and can vary depending on the observer's velocity. This means that two observers moving at different speeds may experience time differently, a phenomenon known as time dilation. General relativity further expanded this concept by introducing gravity's effect on time. Massive objects like planets and stars can warp space-time, causing time to slow down near them. This has been confirmed through experiments, such as observing time differences between synchronized atomic clocks placed at varying altitudes. The Fabric of Space-Time Einstein's theory of general relativity revolutionized our understanding of time and space, merging them into a single entity, space-time. Massive objects like stars and planets warp this fabric, affecting the flow of time around them. This means that time isn't a constant, universal tick-tock. It's flexible and influenced by gravity. Astronauts aboard the ISS experience time slightly differently than we do on Earth. Due to the weaker gravitational field, time passes a bit faster for them, a phenomenon confirmed by precise atomic clocks. The Block Universe Theory Enter the Block Universe Theory, which posits that past, present, and future all coexist simultaneously. In this view, time is like a loaf of bread, with each slice representing a moment. Our consciousness moves through these slices, giving us the illusion of time flowing. This perspective suggests that the future is as fixed as the past, challenging our notions of free will and the uniqueness of the present moment. Imagine the universe as a DVD. All scenes, past, present, and future, exist on the disc. When we watch the movie, we experience the scenes sequentially, but they're all there from the start. Similarly, in the block universe, every moment in time exists, and our consciousness moves through them. The illusion of the present. If all moments exist equally, why do we experience a present moment? Some physicists argue that the present is a psychological construct, a result of how our brains process information. Our consciousness stitches together sensory inputs to create a continuous experience, giving us the illusion of a flowing present. This idea challenges our deeply held beliefs about time and raises profound questions about free will and determinism. Quantum Mechanics and Time Quantum mechanics adds another layer of complexity. At the quantum level, particles can exist in multiple states simultaneously, and their behavior isn't strictly bound by linear time. Some interpretations even suggest that events can influence the past, a concept known as retrocausality. Some interpretations suggest that time may not be a fundamental aspect of reality but an emergent property arising from more basic, timeless laws. Others propose that time could be an illusion resulting from entanglement and correlations between particles. These theories are still speculative, but they highlight the ongoing debate about time's true nature. 
Experiments like the delayed choice quantum eraser have shown results that defy classical notions of time, implying that our understanding of cause and effect may need re-evaluation. Peter Linz, Challenging the Flow of Time In 2003, New Zealand physicist Peter Linz proposed a controversial idea, time doesn't flow, and there's no such thing as a precise now. Instead, events occur in a sequence without distinct moments. Linz argues that our perception of time's flow is an illusion. He suggests that the universe is in a constant state of flux, with events happening continuously but without a defined present. This perspective aligns with certain interpretations of quantum mechanics and challenges the traditional view of time as a series of discrete instants. Time and consciousness. Our understanding of time is deeply intertwined with consciousness. Neuroscientists study how the brain perceives time, revealing that our sense of duration and sequence is malleable. Experiments show that our perception of time can be distorted by factors like attention, emotion, and even drugs. This suggests that our experience of time is subjective and constructed by the brain. If time is a mental construct, what does that mean for our understanding of reality? Implications for free will and determinism. If all moments in time exist equally, and the flow of time is an illusion, what does that mean for free will? In a block universe, the future is as fixed as the past. This raises questions about whether our choices are predetermined or if we have the agency to shape our destinies. Philosophers and physicists continue to debate these issues, exploring the interplay between time, causality, and human freedom. Time as a human construct. Some physicists argue that time is not a fundamental aspect of the universe but a construct of human consciousness. Our brains perceive time to organize experiences and anticipate future events. Without consciousness, the universe might exist in a timeless state. This perspective aligns with the idea that time's passage is a psychological phenomenon, not a physical one. Implications and philosophical. If time is an illusion, what does that mean for our understanding of reality? Are our memories of the past and expectations of the future just mental constructs? Does this challenge the concept of free will? These questions have profound implications, not just for physics but for philosophy, psychology, and our daily lives. The quest for a unified theory. Understanding time is crucial for developing a unified theory of physics. Reconciling general relativity and quantum mechanics, a goal known as quantum gravity, requires a coherent model of time. Various approaches, like string theory and loop quantum gravity, attempt to address this. The nature of time remains one of the most profound mysteries in science. While we may not have all the answers, exploring the nature of time pushes the boundaries of human understanding. Whether time is an illusion or a fundamental aspect of the cosmos, the journey to comprehend it continues to captivate scientists and thinkers alike.